Hey guys, welcome back to the channel here. First stop, I would like to wish a happy 4th of July to my American subscribers out there. And uh, I got some pickups from Wastewise uh, from last week, last Wednesday, Friday, and even Saturday I went there and had some pickups. And uh, DVDs, Blu-rays, and uh, I think one DVD box set here as well, yep. So let's uh, take a look here and see what I picked up. Alright, first up we have this one here, 2012 Supernova. This is one of those disaster movies. I actually just watched this last hour or so, and uh, it was pretty shit-tacular, if I say so myself here. That's a one-time watch only, and uh, yeah, I'm probably going to end up donating it right back. I'll probably never watch that movie again in my life. Wow, it stunk. <laughs> it's pretty terrible. Cheesy effects in it. And uh, this one dude here on the back here, right there, is uh, Brian Kraus from uh, Sleepwalkers, if you remember that movie. But in this movie, he reminded, he looked a lot like Matthew Lillard to me. Every time they kept showing him in this movie here, it always reminded me of the dude from Scream. And, uh, yeah, it was garbage. That movie, bleh. Bleh. Garbage. I'll never watch that one again, and I'm going to donate that one right back. Man, that can go. I don't care if I paid a dollar for it. It was a dollar too much. Oh, well. So, anyway, moving on here, uh, we have Adventures in Zambezia. And I actually also watched this earlier on today. Has a pretty decent cast here. Samuel L. Jackson, Leonard Nimoy, Jeff Goldblum, Abigail Breslin, and Jeremy Suarez. This was a really colorful, fun type movie. I, I enjoyed this one. This one was pretty good. So if you ever see that one out in the wild, I, I recommend this one. This one was pretty, pretty good. I enjoyed that one. Then next up, we have this one in a slim case here. The Sound of Music, 40th Anniversary Edition. It's in one of those really slim cases here. And uh, the discs are, they're all right condition. I'm hoping that they're not too badly scratched as I would like that one to replace my old classic VHS tape here. So if, if it's got not, not bad scratches on here, I'd like to replace my VHS version here if I could. So... All right, moving on, we have this one here. Turner Classic Movies, Greatest Classic Films Collection, A Night at the Opera, Arsenic and Old Lace, Father of the Bride, The Long Long Trailer. Another old school collection here. And for a dollar, how can you go wrong, man? If I ordered that online, I'd be paying more in shipping alone. So that's a steal. This one I did have once before, and I was an idiot and sold it, so I bought it again here for a dollar. And as you can see, it's still brand new, factory sealed. Mamma Mia, the movie here, and I'll I'll give this one a chance. I, I didn't really watch it the first time around that I had it, and I end up selling it like an idiot, and end up rebuying it again, the widescreen version, as you can tell here. So I'm sure it's a decent movie, and I'll give it another shot here. So. Up next, we have The Mountain Men, Charlton Heston. I don't know too much about this one, but it looked all right. And for, again, for a dollar, I'll give her a shot. Then we have this one, Kung Fu Panda Holiday, still brand new, factory sealed. I believe I've got all the Kung Fu Panda movies, one, two, and three, in my collection on DVD and Blu-ray, one form or another. So I'll give this one a watch as well. Then we have this one called Sweet Vengeance. How far would you go to get even? One of those vengeful type movies, I guess. An old blockbuster rental. So give that one a watch. And then we have The Stranger. As you can see, brand new, still sealed. Another old school classic movie. Definitely give that one a watch. Then we have Winnie the Pooh. Brand new, factory sealed. And I was fairly certain that I had this one. And let me get it out here. And I do. 
It's this one here with the DVD and Blu-ray. But I just took a look at this one here. Uh, the Blu-ray is in mint shape. The DVD is fairly scratched up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open this one up and swap the DVD out with this one. And put the new DVD in this one here. So, and then that way they're both in great shape. And then I'll just donate the other one back. So, I'm going to be definitely holding on to this one for sure. The, the combo pack here. DVD Blu-ray combo pack. And up next we have the Pirates. Band of Misfits. Laugh your booty off, I believe it said there. Yep. <laughs> and this is probably another fun one to watch here. So we'll give her we'll give her a watch for sure. And then this one, the Tooth Fairy Part 2 with Larry the Cable Guy. I'm sure this one's uh, pretty stupid, but eh. I don't mind Larry the Cable Guy. He's pretty he's okay. Definitely not the worst actor that I've seen, that's for sure. Then we have The Road to El Dorado DVD here. Solid gold, says Joel Siegel. And this one replaces my old classic VHS tape of it here. So hopefully again that it's not too badly scratched up. I don't believe it is. I think the disc is in really great shape. So I can finally get rid of my old... VHS tape of that one there. So then we have this seven pack. Uh includes seven bonus movies, the borrowers. Still factory sealed here, as you can see. Whoop. Slip there. And you can see the list of the extra movies there. It's an Echo Bridge release there. Then we have this one, the 16 movies adventure collection. Another one from Echo Bridge. They release all these huge combo movies here. Multi-pack. Mm. Yeah, I'm sure it's a pretty decent collection. We'll get around to watching them here. And this one again from Echo Bridge. Seven movies, Spirit of the North collection. See the list of the movies there. Awesome. Then we have Comic-Con. Episode 4, Fans Hope on Blu-ray here. Combo, DVD, Blu-ray. Is Morgan Spurlock. Who you see there from Super Size Me, if you remember that one. A great documentary where he ate McDonald's for like a month straight. And damn near almost killed him. <laughs> wow. Yeah, we'll give that a watch. I've been to numerous Comic Cons and stuff over the years, so I'm sure that one will be very interesting. Then this one here, Eat, Pray, Love, has got the uh, slip. And as you remember, my other one, I've got that one as well. And you can see that this one's got a multi-language here, I guess, English and French. Whereas that one just has, is just a straight-up American version, as you can see here. So, um, I don't know. I, I don't know. We'll see what I'll do with that one. I haven't decided yet. And this one, I found the Simpsons... Complete third season, still brand new, sealed. I paid $5 for that one. I hope it wasn't too expensive. You know, I think that was a pretty decent enough price. So, we'll give that one a watch for sure. Crash uh, is a really nice slip. And I love me my slips here. I'm sure that's a great movie. I also have this one on Blu-ray, so I I don't know if I'm going to be keeping this one. I, I might just, I don't know. I like it for the slip, so I might just hold on to that one. So Then we have the Rescuers Down Under Disney Gold Collection here on DVD. I'm sure this is going to be a great movie. And this one actually replaces my classic VHS version here, as you can see. So I'll be donating that one right back. So there you go. And finally, to round out this haul is the Care Bears movie in a nice pink case here. I believe I had this one again at one point or another and end up selling it. So for a dollar, I decided to pick it up again. Disc is in mint shape, so I'll give it another shot. Why not? What the hell? It's only a dollar, so no big deal. So yeah, that uh, that rounds out 
my latest pickups from Wastewise here. So I appreciate the new subscribers. You like what you see? Please hit that thumbs up, share, subscribe to my channel. And uh, yeah, and I appreciate everything. And take care, guys. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you in the next video. All right, take care, guys.